One of the things that really struck us so was um, so many people responded to this. Page 13, you don't become good by trying to be good, mm -hmm. but by finding the goodness that is already within you and allowing that goodness to emerge. But it can only emerge if something fundamental changes in your state of consciousness. Yes. So what that means, if, if nothing changes in your state of consciousness, the ego has many ideas. It says, I want to be a spiritual person. Mm -hmm. I, I want to be recognized as a spiritual person. I want to be more spiritual than all these people. Mm -hmm. And I'm definitely more spiritual than you. Mm -hmm. So the ego has all kinds of ideas of what it wants to be. It might even say, yes, I want to be good because it wants to have a better image of itself. But on that level, but the, the essential dysfunction of the ego is still operating. So this is why we have the phrase, the road to hell is paved with good intentions. Because no matter how good your intentions are, when you're still trapped in the ego, it will always take you into conflict eventually. So you have to go deeper beyond the realm of opposites where there's good and bad and reach a place within yourself that is unconditioned, that is what I sometimes call the formless, expressed beautifully in the Old Testament, in the little saying, be still and know that I am God. Mm -hmm. That is, and that's in the Old Testament, it contains the entire wisdom of religion in those few words. Be still, meaning go to that place where the mind is no longer operating, where there's, you are just conscious without thinking. And that is the level where the eternal resides.